Hey, what's up, guys? So I got another video from Hitman 2, the Last Resort DLC on Haven Island. So this is going to be my starting setup. I'm going to have the Jaeger 7 to tour waiting for me. I'm going to have the Silver Ballers on me. I'm going to start at the Shark Hut. I'm going to have the Lock Pick and the Coin. And in this video, I'm going to get the two secret achievements slash trophies, the Dundee and the Pleasure. So the Dundee is going to be... The description was uh, make like the famous Aussie and leave. So you're basically going to shoot all the inflatable uh, crocodiles around the level. And then that'll open up an exit after you kill the three targets. Then you could leave on one of the inflatable crocodiles. Uh, the second one, the pleasure. You're going to be shooting all these decorated skulls all around the board. And then that's going to open up a ghost ship that's going to appear at the back of the mansion where you kill Tyson Williams. And I thought that was probably... The cooler of the two and so i'm starting right here i'm in the shark hut this is going to be the first skull so just use the silver baller uh, obviously make sure you're, you have silencers on your weapons because you're going to be shooting out in the open so i'm picking up my sniper rifle here and i'm going to be able to take out uh three skulls just from this spot alone uh they're a little tough shots so this is probably the best sniper rifle in the game so i got some really good zoom and you got the uh, slow down mechanic if you slightly depress the right trigger so it's going to be over here uh, on another island it's going to be between these two beach chairs uh, make sure that you see like the skull shatter and make to make sure you got it so the second one's going to be up in the radio tower right there so i think i missed a couple shots just make sure i try to use the depress to slow down time but it's kind of annoying it's almost easier just not to use it so there you go, I got that one. And then the third one from this position is going to be right here in the plane at this angle. That's a real easy shot. So I haven't killed any of the targets. Uh, most of these videos that I saw, wink wink, I mean I figured this out all on my own, I swear. Um, they killed the targets and then they start the video from there. I'm actually going to kill the targets as I go just to give you a complete guide on um, running through this so you'll see everything that I do there's no you know no secrets so I'm gonna pack up my uh, sniper rifle because obviously I can't run around with that in my current um, outfit I think I saved right there and I'm gonna head back here to where the doctor uh, walks around and that gold digger that he brought with them to the island and I'm gonna shoot uh, the two crocodiles right here pop and pop And instead of running across the hut, I'm just going to go around and underneath. And this is going to take me to the empty cabin with that key that was a pain in the ass to find. And I'm going to get the third crocodile in this area. It's going to be right up here on the deck. But watch out that you, uh, I'm not in the disguise yet, so you're trespassing right here. So just do it quick and then get the hell out of the way. And I didn't, I didn't calculate that I would lose my <laughs> briefcase, so I almost got caught. So I picked it up and I took off. Oh shit! All right, so now I'm gonna head over to where the uh, scuba instructor is, and I'm gonna take out Stephen Bradley just because he was a target of opportunity here. He just happened to be walking around. Um, I didn't plan on it. I plan on shooting the. Uh, I think there's seven crocodiles here. Five in the front section of the little building and then two in the back and then I noticed that Stephen Bradley was there so I said what the hell I'll just take him out now I'm going to eventually have to take him take out two targets to get the ghost ship to appear because you're going to need the stormy weather and that only happens when you take out two targets and then I'm going to obviously have to take out all the targets to make the crocodile uh, exit so I just found my angle just took a quick headshot lady almost walked right in the way of it so instead of shooting the crocodiles there, I'm just going to let the um, the situation kind of calm down while they're searching. And I'm going to grab two other crocodiles over here at the pool. You can see them right here. Uh, I don't know if I could have shot them out in the open. I might have, but I, I just got covered just in case. So I could see the green one from here, kind of. I'm trying to find an angle, but not the, the other one that was black. So I gotta move around a little bit to uh, get an angle on that. So pretty much all the crocodiles will be 
done except for two in the mansion when I'm finished before I go to the mansion there's two in the back they'll be the last two so I'm just trying to figure out um, how I can get a shot Alright, so I got that one. So now I'm going to go back to the instructor's hut, instructor's hut and take out the uh, seven there. And I thought this was a cool little, uh, two little Easter egg, and then they put uh, achievement and trophies on them. Um, I don't know who the hell finds this shit, um, but it's um, definitely something to... Uh, give you some extra gameplay to, to make you uh, keep playing alright so I'm just gonna take this guy out so I can get out of uh, just have some kind of security this guy's to help me uh, run around with and shooting so make sure you have a coin or some kind of distraction I'm gonna use the lockpick later to open up a door to the uh, security hut where that one piece of the treasure map was so that's why I brought that. Okay, so I got this guys, and now I'm just gonna go shoot these crocodiles. So what is this? We got, we got the three in the back, the two at the pool, and then we're gonna have five here. So there's gonna be one, two, three, four leaned up against the wall. And then we're gonna have one that's actually kind of hidden at the table. It's underneath the table, and it's kind of blocked. You can see it right there. Right there. So that's five. And then you're going to have two inside this little building to the left. Bam, bam. Alright, so that's seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So that's twelve. And I'm going to go right across to uh, shoot another skull. This is where I was saying I needed the lockpick. So this is skull, what, five? We had one at the shark hut, one across the way, one in the plane, one on the radio tower. Yeah, so I think it's five. So shoot that and get the hell out of the way. Now I'm going to head over to the uh, beach area uh, right underneath where Vitrova gets the uh, poison food where you see the uh, sea captain overlooking that area. And we're going to get uh, four more alligators. Uh, no, I lied. So before we head over there, I'm going to get this skull real quick that's in this bar. You can see it on the shelf. Just kind of get in the bushes so you're concealed. Don't shoot the bartender. And it's right there. Bam. So that's six. Alright, so now I'm going to head over to the beach and get those crocodiles. I just try to find the way to do it. To where I'm just not doing one at a time, so you could do them both in the same video or the same run, so you get both achievements. Not have to worry about doing it twice. Have to do everything in two separate runs. So there's the third one from the area, and then the fourth one's going to be underneath the um, patio here. And I did save right after this, and then when I reloaded it. It looks like the ones I shot were inflated again, so I wasn't sure if they counted, but they do. They count, even though if you already shot it and then you reload and then it looks inflated, don't worry about shooting it again. It counts. It's still, even though it's inflated, it's still counted as being shot. So I don't know if uh, killing Bradley activates it, but after uh, I killed him, Vitrova starts heading over to the uh, the spa area for a massage, and then that opened up a way to assassinate her. So, but before I do that, I'm going to grab a new disguise because I'm going to need it for this island and I'm going to need it for the mansion to walk around the mansion. So I'm going to take out Vitrova here and I'm also going to shoot uh, a skull that's inside of the spa on one of the shelves. This was kind of pain in the, pain in the ass because you got three guys so you got to be careful. Um, I would, now nah, this probably, the hardest part is the mansion area because there's just so many guards and you gotta shoot, uh, a few skulls inside of the mansion, so you gotta be careful. And another trick to make it easier is 
to wait to kill Tyson. You don't have to kill him to get the ghost ship to appear. So, wait to kill him because I killed him before. And then when I was gonna, when I was looking at the ghost ship, uh, all the guards are running around like crazy, and then they end up finding me, and it kind of ruined my uh, my viewing experience of when the ship was sailing. So just see the ship first, then kill him. Then you can just run out and make your exit onto the alligator. You'll see when I get there. So I got the new disguise. I'm gonna circle around. Watch out, this guy can see through your disguise. And I'm gonna do like a big roundabout. And I'm going to find a nice angle to use the sniper rifle to get her while she's laying down. So all this time, she's basically on the phone saying how she's going to um, backstab Stephen Bradley. And uh, leave, the, uh, leave him the blame for whatever she plans to do. And then she lays down for the uh, massage. So you're going to come all the way around. And you should have a good angle. On her and the skull. I'll show you here. Alright, so you can see your instinct. She's laying down. Just try not to shoot the uh, the lady there. So I got her. I'm going to have to move a little bit over to the right to get a good angle on the skull. Zoom in. You see it right there next to the tails. Bam. Alright, cool. So pack it up. And we're going to head over to the uh, private island. We're going to get two more. One's going to be in the sunken wreckage. And then the other one's going to be sitting at the bar. Uh, the sunken wreckage one was weird. Like, if you just use your pistol and aim, you won't see it. But if you zoom in with the sniper rifle, uh, you'll get a glimpse of it. Or unless you can find a better angle that I didn't realize. And then the one at the bar would just be sitting on the shelf. Just try not to be seen by the uh, the bartender. That guy shouldn't see you. He didn't see me when I did this. So I just ran out to it. Wouldn't let me go no more. And then I shot it with the sniper rifle. Like I was saying, you can't see it with the baller. Kind of a pain in the ass because you got to do this whole animation every time. But and then you can see perfect, not perfect, but the good majority of it right there. Like I said, make sure you see it explode. Alright, now I'm going to head over to the uh, bar area. And then we're going to head over to the mansion. There's going to be two more alligators at the mansion. They'll be the last two. And then we're going to have... Got one, two, three... I think four. Four more skulls after this at the mansion area. We're going to have one in a fish tank, two in the little movie theater room with the projector. We're going to have one in the room where where Tyson gets the uh, the checkup from the doctor. And I think that's it. And then after that, uh, then there's going to be one more on that big yacht in the back. That's That'll be the last skull. When you shoot that one, the achievement will pop up, the pleasure achievement. And then if you wait a few seconds, that's when the ghost ship will appear. And then I'll show you what it looks like. It's pretty cool. And then I realized, I saw somebody had a video where if you collect all the Haven pamphlets, um, and then do something else, I forget. And you can have a tornado up here with cows in it or some shit. Alright, so there's two skulls here. Make sure you shoot the one that's decorated right there. It's going to make this guard jump up. Uh, I wasn't even sure if I hit it because I can't, couldn't really tell. So I'm going to run around and knock him out so I can get a closer look. But like I said, there's one another skull to the left. Just make sure you don't shoot that one. Make sure you shoot the one that's kind of in the um, the coral there. Watch out for this, these two guards out here. They can see through your disguise. So now I'm going to head upstairs to the theater room. There's going to be two skulls in here. Um, but you got to be careful. Sometimes Tyson's walking around with his with his guard up here, so you got to um, you got to watch out. You know, watch out. That guy can see through your disguise, but if you just run real quick, he won't see you. And you're gonna need a lockpick for this room too. 
So I think right before I got there, Tyson left. So I'm going to knock him out. And then you can see the skull right there. And then there's going to be a skull right here. So I'll go around so you can see it better. Alright, so now I'm going to go get the second to last skull. And then I'm going to not take out Tyson. I'm going to let him live until I can... Um, see the ghost ship so I can see it without being bothered so just get out of there once once everybody's kind of trying to figure out what's going on just get out of the, get out of the room let them calm down I'm gonna head out back I'm gonna get the last two crocodiles will be right here in the pool and if you didn't know, if you wanted to get that guy to jump, you just shoot that lady down there, and he'll jump in, and you'll get that uh, secret challenge. So this boat was kind of a pain in the ass. I got lucky. During this run, it wasn't rocking. I guess I don't know. The storm didn't hit it yet, or, but if the storm's going, it'll be. If you, I think, if you kill Tyson, it'll be going up and down really hard, and it'll make it a real tough shot. So the achievement should pop up for you right there. I already did it, so it, it already popped up for me. But right now, you're just going to wait, and then you'll see the ghost ship just come up out of the sea. And then it'll float across the screen. You see it coming up there. Alright, so I'm going to follow it, and then I'm going to finish off Tyson. And then I'm going to go run to the beach area. And then I'm going to jump on the inflatable crocodile to get the the Dundee achievement. And then that'll be it. So I just wanted to run through everything. So you guys, there was, everything was clear. Um, there was no confusion. Alright, so if you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. I'll see you guys later. Bye. What was that? I've got a body on the ground. I'm moving it. Hey, you. Yeah, yeah, you. Tyson Williams eliminated. Excellent work, 47. That's all we need to do from here. Miss Hall should be able to extract the information needed from the Haven servers. Good work, 47.
I knew our nameless friend would come through.